Sometimes I like slim, sometimes I like dick Sometimes I come by and I like them slick Them slick probably went over your head Couldn't lay up, I just went, went over for head wow. Made her change the plans when she bent over the bed And now she on the balcony, pent over the ledge wow. It's been a few days, but I sent over some bread It can get rough with tuition Hi, um, yeah, hey everyone, it's me, Amir, I'm back, um, if you care, you know, if you don't, I'm sorry about it. So I know I've been gone for like three months, um, here's the reason why. So the piece of shit, um, that I have for a computer, um, the editing software on it doesn't really work anymore and like it was just slow and clunky and I literally only had that computer for like two years and it was already acting stupid so I was like you know what I'm just gonna work my ass off over the summer and buy a MacBook and now I have a MacBook Pro period period so yeah um that's the tea on that so that's the reason why I have not vlogged made a video any of that so yeah also, I'll be making a special announcement about where I'm going to be possibly making my videos from now on. Well, not for now on, but like sometimes and like, yeah, because some big things are coming for me. So, yeah, well, big things to me. They're not huge, but they're big to me. So, yeah, I really don't know what this video is going to be like. You're basically going to see some stuff of me attempting to do a vlog and then it's probably going to lean into back to school stuff i don't know just enjoy the chaos that this video is and i promise you i will have a better vlog or actual video um next week um so that's the tea and yeah so let's just you know get on the roll and let's Get started. So, I'm out. It's hot as hell. I'm dying. Um, I did not know that it was when they literally said it was gonna be the hottest day of the year. They were not lying because I'm burning up. But you know what? It's fine. I need some vitamin D because apparently my doctor told me I'm low on vitamin D. So. I guess maybe going out into the sunshine will do something. I don't even know. Things we have to accomplish today. Um, I guess just chilling, just being by myself in Center City. Um, I used to do this all the time in junior year of high school because I didn't have any friends. So I kind of miss doing that, like doing stuff by myself. I don't know why, but I just do. Like I'm so fixated on hanging out with my friends that I don't even give myself time to myself. So I'm just like, you know what, Amir, why don't you just give your day to yourself, do something for yourself, and yeah. Then the other thing we have to do is um, I'm going to this Rec Philly meeting. So there's this place called Rec Philly where like creators and stuff can like collab and work on their content and stuff and I'm planning on signing up for them and they invited me to like a bunch of events. I went to their strategy session and it really opened my eyes to like the kind of videos I want to make in the future and all that. And um, then he also invited me to this thing they're doing tonight. I thought it was a town hall because it said Rec Philly Town Hall, but it's actually at University City, which is all the way in West Philly. So I have to go there at 5.30. So yeah, I have to be there at 5.30. Yay for me. Um, and that's T on that. So I'm actually walking up to the subway station um, I was going to take the actual train and be bougie, but, um, I don't feel like paying $5 for the train. So, that's the tea. I'm hoping I can catch an express so I don't have to stop at every fucking station on the planet. So, yeah. Hey, feeling good. Like I should. When in the blue Okay, so I'm here in Center City. Now, I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Because, like, I have no plan. But the only plan I have for today is the thing I'm supposed to do at the end of the day. So.
so that's, so that's kind of an issue. So I think we're gonna go get something to eat because I'm currently starving. So I'm gonna go to this place I haven't been to in a while. It's called Honey Grow. They serve like these, this really good like stir fry. I'm gonna go there and get something to eat. They're expensive though, so. Honey grow. It was really good, really delicious, really um, scrumptious. But now I'm going to go to Zaxby's because I've been hearing some rumors that it's better than Starbucks. So I don't know if that's true, but we're gonna test it out today. Nar she blows. Okay, so I just came out of Zaxby's. I got a mocha, so we're gonna test her out. Okay, so luckily I found my lights. Um, I think it's going up. They said it goes up to 65 feet, but I just got two of them just in case. I mean, if I didn't really need two of them, then I guess I could put them all around the room because I don't know. But it was nice. So we're now in the haul portion of this video. We gotta do this quick because it is hot as hell and my aunt and uncle's downstairs and I am literally burning up. I'm like sweating, I'm burning, I need to take a shower, all that. So yeah, I'm sorry I'm doing this when I look absolutely disgusting. Um, I have not showered yet, brushed my teeth, the only thing I've done is eat breakfast. Yeah, I'm sorry I look really disgusting for you guys. I didn't mean to, I'm sorry about it. I don't know what to do. This is probably gonna be the fastest haul you will ever see because I need to go upstairs to my air conditioned room because I am hot. So let's get started. Okay, so for the first part of my haul, of course, is my MacBook. Um, this was about $1,400. Yeah, so it was actually worth the investment, honestly, because like this is gonna last me at least 10 years. Unlike my other computer that only lasts me like, what, two years? And it was really made out of plastic, which isn't really a good material for, like, a computer anyway. This is made out of aluminum, I think, is what MacBooks are mostly made out of, like, aluminum or something. I was going to get a case for this, but then I was like, you know what, I'm not really going to be going outside with it, to be honest. I'm going to only be using it indoors. And I'm mostly going to be keeping it in a bag anyway. The only time I'm going to take it out is when I need to edit something or whatever. I just like the f aluminum feel in it so I'm not really sure if I'm gonna get the case for this plus I'm already gonna be careful with this and I also have Apple Care anyway so yeah I have three years of Apple Care on this so yeah so the bundle I got with the MacBook came with a free pair of Beats headphones it was a college student bundle discount thing came with the MacBook um which was discounted which was a hundred dollars off the MacBook um and I also got a free pair of Beats um, with the bundle and 20% off of Apple Care. Um, also, this is not sponsored by Apple. I'm pretty sure Apple will never sponsor me, but Apple, if you do want to sponsor me, I have, you know, an iPhone. I'm, I'm proud. I'm actually going to get a new phone soon. I don't know if I'm going to get the X Max or the XR. I don't know which one I'm going to get. But yeah, I have, you know, I always buy an iPhone every year. This is my first time having a MacBook, but like I always love your MacBooks. Your MacBook is amazing. Um, you know, I, I have your AirPods. The only thing I don't have is your Apple Watch because I don't have Jay-Z Beyonce money. So, you know, Apple sponsor me, I guess. I don't even know. Boy, you know good and well this is not about the sponsors. You better sit your behind down somewhere, okay? So, it came with these free pair of Beats. I got them in this like cream color with like gold accents. I love these. I just love the color and like, I don't know. I just can't believe they really gave these away for free with the MacBook. Like I was really shocked. With the bundle, you can get any pair of beats for free. Like any model, any color, period. Period. Um, and that's the T. 
well not well any model that's like you know an actual headset not like the earbuds but you can get these but you can get any model that is a pair of like these like these for free next thing i got was a mattress pad um my aunt told me that every year i should buy a new mattress pad because like you know it can just because like you know college other people sitting on your bed see i got this um, honestly, I see where my, where my aunt's coming from because, like, you don't know what other people have been on that bed frame. But honestly, like, this is a, I'm gonna be living in a new residence hall, so no one's been on the bed frame. But still buy a new one. You don't know what's on there. Honestly, you really don't. I got, um, it's a waterproof allergy protector zippered pillow protector. So this is, like, basically a pillow protector, and it's helps with people with allergies like me, you know, because during the seasons, you guys already know, I start sounding like I have the black plague. So, I basically, um, in my new residence hall, they have um, a communal kitchen. So I was like, I need some kitchen supplies because I wanna save money this year and cook my own food because I don't wanna keep buying Chipotle every week and plus I have bills to pay so like I need to be more careful with my money because last year I was not careful. I was a dumb little freshman You know, I was spending money here and there and everywhere and I can't be doing that this year because I have bills to pay Also the little announcement I was talking about at the beginning of the video was that I'm gonna be doing starting doing some of my videos at this place called the rec um, I'm gonna be signing up for the $40 a month membership um, it's a really cool place. Um, I'm gonna leave a link to it down below. If you live in Philly or in the tri-state area, check it out. It's a really good place to like, you know, do videos, collaborate with other creators, ho hopefully help you get jobs and internships, things like that. And they're also gonna have a new space in Center City, which I'm so excited to use because that would be so much easier for me instead of going all the way to North Philly. That would be so much easier to go to this base in Center City because I can just get on the train, go to Jefferson Station, and I can just walk into the place and... Yeah. I mean, if you live in Philly, you know what I'm talking about, so... Yeah. I got this, um, cookware set. Um, my aunt kind of told me I was wasting my money because, like, what kind of cooking am I going to be doing? I guess it's because she thinks I can't cook. Actually, no one does. Um, the only thing I really know how to cook is eggs, maybe bacon, sausage, basically any breakfast item you ask for, I can cook. Um, I don't really know how to cook anything else but that. I cook chicken like once. Yeah, hopefully, this will force me to start learning how to cook for myself because no one's really taught me how to cook. I was kind of self-taught. Um, my uh, the only thing my uncle really taught me how to cook was eggs, and that was when, and that was when I was like what ten? Or, oh no, not ten. Um, I was like what twelve or eleven? So like, hopefully this will force me to start cooking. Um, because I want to really save money this year and like you know cook for myself and buy groceries and things like that. So yeah. All right. You better still be recording. So I got um these utility dishcloths. Then I have. A non-stick cake pan. You know, you never know when I want to make brownies or maybe bake a cake. We'll see how that works out. Maybe I'll make it. I probably am gonna make a video where I make brownies or tr attempt to make a cake. I've never made a cake before, so I don't know how that's gonna work out. But it's fine. Next, I got some decor. I got these USB LED mood lights. I was gonna get lights from this Instagram called The Lit Lights, but they wanted $35 for some strip lights. I was like $4.98, and these are what, like 65 feet? I forgot to show the rest of my kitchen stuff. I got this from Walmart. It's a slotted spoon. I don't know when I'm gonna need this. Probably if I'm cooking greens or something. I don't know, but yeah, I got that. Then I got a spatula and I got some oven mitts. You never know what I'm going to be baking, so I need some grandma mitts. I also got a plate. Another plate. I didn't really have a reusable, I mean, I did have a reusable plate. I don't know where I put it, though. I'm pretty sure it's in one of the bins. We'll find out. Then I have this big spoon. I don't know which really use this for, but we're going to find out. Then I got this big ass knife. I should have got a knife set, but I was like, why do I need a whole knife set? I'm not Gordon Ramsay. I'm not Betty Crocker. So that's that on the kitchen items. So I think that's all for my haul and this 
whole video back to school slash random vlog. I, yeah. So I hope you guys did enjoy this video um, and all of its chaos. Leave a comment down below. Also, if you're new to my channel, hi, how are you doing? I hope you enjoyed this video as well. Make sure to subscribe if um, you want to. I'm pretty sure you do, you know, because you want to see this face every week, right? Right? Like this video, comment. Um, comment down below um, what college you're going to or what college do you go to. Um, what high school you go to if you're a high schooler, you know. Um, what college are you planning on going to um, in the fall or, in a, or just in a few weeks. Um, you know, all of that. So yeah, um, I'll see you guys later next week with a brand new video. Bye. Yay. Um... I'm not good with these outros, just bye. <laughs>